I'm Sarah. Welcome to The Daily English Show. Have you ever seen Forrest Gump? If you have, you might enjoy a video called Forrest Gump in One Minute in One Take. I think it's really well done. As you can probably guess from the title, it tells the whole story of Forrest Gump briefly in one take. The narration starts like this. I'm going to tell you the story of my life because I'm simple. When I was young, I had to wear special shoes and I met a girl called Jenny. And through some miracle, I didn't need my special shoes no more. I ran so well, I played football. I got to meet the President of the United States. And then Jenny came back, but she left again. And you can go and watch the video to see how it ends. If you've spent a bit of time drinking and playing pool, like me, then you may have noticed that you seem to get better at playing pool as you drink. My friends and I used to talk about this theory quite a lot and test it out, but not in any scientific way. And now I find that some professors at Acadia University are actually researching it. They've called it the beer window and there's a video about it on the Acadia channel on YouTube, so go and check it out if you're interested. I'm sure they're having fun doing that research. Kia ora, in stick news today, there's a restaurant chain in Taiwan where people eat out of toilets. A recent article in Time magazine reviewed a restaurant called Modern Toilet. The reviewer said it was a popular restaurant chain where customers eat sitting on toilet seats. Meals are served in mini toilet bowls and drinks in plastic urinals. Dessert is served on a squat toilet-shaped dish. One diner was quoted as saying it was a little gross, but very progressive and irreverent, like a practical joke. And that was Stick News for Thursday the 5th of March. Kia ora. Yeah, I'm snow water. No, it's my first time. I've never been to Japan. I mean, like, I've never been to Japan is the mountain. So it's my first time in Hokkaido and I've never seen this kind of awesome powder. So it was pretty interesting. Oh yeah, it's totally different from the Korea and actually I went to Canada last year and then there there was some powder but it was it wasn't the like the best the Nisek was powder, so it's it's awesome. <laughs> Today's word is irreverent. In today's news, someone said the toilet restaurant was irreverent. So what does irreverent mean? Irreverent, adjective, usually approving, not showing respect to somebody something that other people usually respect. So it's kind of like disrespectful, but in a good way. Why does drinking alcohol make you better at pool? Alcohol makes you relax so you can concentrate better. But surely it's not good if you're too relaxed. The guy in the video said it was something about your heart rate and also the relaxing effect. Yeah, I think that's what he said. Yeah, I think you have to drink the right amount for it to have a positive effect on your gain. Not showing respect to somebody, something that other people usually respect. A. Irrefutable. B. Irrelevant. C. Irrepressible. D. Irreproachable. E. Irreverent. Irreverent. Not important to or connected with a situation. Irrelevant. Impossible to deny or disprove. Irrefutable. 
lively, happy and full of energy, irrepressible, beyond criticism, irreproachable. And that was The Daily Englisher. See you tomorrow. Bye.